Okay, so today, for anybody who doesn't know me, <laughs> oh, this it's in there. Y'all can see me? I can see you, but you're a little, um, it's a little faded. I Hold think on. Oh, what there about we now? There we go. Okay, I'll be here. <laughs> hey, Ty. <laughs> I missed you. I missed you. I miss you. It's what, How many days has it been since Tuesday? And like, you know what I'm saying? But, Love it. You know, I always miss you. It's that fairy swag. You know, you know how that go. You know how that go. Where and, you what you said? Where you at? What's I'm at home right now. Um, you know, it's definitely a lot of kids here to play with my baby. You know, it's okay, guys. <laughs> so that's what's going on. That's what you hear in the background. Nice. So you're in Atlanta. I am, and you're in LA. Hey, baby, I got, I'm repping it on the hat. Come on. Oh yeah, I see, I see. And yeah. we doing, and we doing, and we get to do another interview with Waka and Tammy, yeah. and we get to meet Charlie this time. That's what I'm excited about. Oh. We get the whole. We get the whole family. Oh, in the background. Yeah, huh? uh, <laughs> it's it's the party going on over here. <laughs> so for everybody who's just tuning in, we are gonna be sitting down and talking with the stars of We TV's What the Flockas. We got Waka Flocka. We got Tammy Rivera. Period. Beautiful daughter Charlie. And we're talking everything. We actually we were talking to them earlier in the week on our show, The Mix. Mm -hmm. And when I tell you they was dropping gym after gym, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Gym, like how to maintain a relationship to how to make it in the industry to not allowing anyone to dim your light to remembering to like keep God first. Mm -hmm. I was I was I was in it like. Right, no, same. We definitely got some good gems. And they talked yeah. so highly of Charlie. So, like, I'm just really excited to meet her. Because I was saying we need to get her in the mix. But we get to talk to her today. It's a yeah. treat. Hopefully after this, she'll come to the mix, too, and kick away. Right. She definitely should come to the mix because we can really get her popping. Hey, hey, come on. You already know. Period. I was, <laughs> oh, I was supposed to get my makeup, man. You look I canceled it. I canceled it. Why you cancel? Because I was just like, you know, I could just be natural for the life. Well, you know, when you got flawless skin like you, when you look like you, uh, you play with makeup. So I don't even get why you put period. Oh, thanks, Anton. You look nice yourself. You have a, like a light going on over there. You have the best lighting. Like, oh, no, really. no, they told me that I was she's, she's locked. So I was like, well, let me let the kid come correct. Yeah, like, hold up. Let me try to pull my ring light closer or something. Hey, come on. <laughs> <laughs> it's me really trying to pull it closer. Yeah, so let me right. On Tuesday, we were talking to Waka. Mm -hmm. He told us that he was about to drop three new singles. Right. New tracks in April. And when I tell you, first of all, when I used to hear that one song, it's a party, it's a party, it's a party. You couldn't tell me that I wasn't the flyest kid. Like, I was just, I was, it, literally, I would play it right before I would go get drunk. And I would go to the club, and it would get me lit and get me turned. So I, I thought you was going to say, um, it's make you feel like you was from Atlanta. Uh, you always trying to have somebody from Atlanta. I swear to God. Because, yeah, let's not forget, you know, it's definitely Atlanta, Riverdale, stuff going on, Waka Flocka. Like, let's not play. We know, you know, Atlanta's finest. Facts. Facts. Period. So, yeah, guys, to remind y'all, everybody who's joining in, we're about to have Waka, Tammy, and Charlie, the whole family, here to join us. We're going to ask them some good questions. We're going to ask some questions from the viewers. So, yeah, stay tuned. Stay tuned. Stick around. Y'all don't want to leave. It's going to be a good one. And before we get the family on here, why don't y'all mm -hmm. just go our handles. Do you know, go follow Anique. Let them know what your Instagram is, please. Zonique, Z-O-N-N. I Q U E J L E J A I L E E. Go follow me. Don't play. Hey. Anton. Yeah. And you can also come follow me, Anton Peoples, A N T O N P E E P L E S, baby. And you can also see the link to our show to mix mm -hmm. while you're at you know, Why not? And 9 p.m. is when the flock is. Come on. We TV. We TV. I'm like, let me make sure I got. All right, baby. So make sure y'all watch the new episode. This is season two, episode two of What the Flockers tonight.
So I feel and, like we're well, time to, to get walking in right now. Should we, yeah, should I was going to say, I just saw he said he was in here, so we should definitely add him in. Can I put my phone on mute? Fuck a plug. Sammy. We're going to get him all in here at one time, right? Yeah, I'm going to get them all together. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, wait, Tammy's is Charlie, right? Oh, no, Charlie's Yeah, Charlie's angel. angel, and then Charlie is Tammy's angel. I love that. I hope my child wants her Instagram to be Zani's angel. Oh. She's not. She's not that, she's not that type of baby already. Oh, wait, I'm not seeing Charlie. Let's see. Mm. Maybe if I just spell out her name. Sorry, let me Hold on, let me see. Can I do it too, or can you only control it? I think it might just be you. Me. Yeah, okay, well, let me get Waka for now. Okay. And then let me add Waka. I just sent the request to Waka. Oh, I'm mad excited. So when he was on the show Tuesday, listen. <laughs> First of all, I didn't know this dude was a Gemini. You already know this they come. Waka. Is that you, bro, bro? Yeah, it is me. I had to go pick up my family food. So I'm like, I love that. family man. <laughs> I couldn't let Uber Eats do it. I had to stay today. Yes, what y'all eating tonight? It's me, hungry. Oh, he got the he got the connection problems. He getting that food. Okay, while his connection is doing his thing, I'm gonna try to wife. Uh huh, uh huh. Jill type her name. Listen, I feel like an old man. Like I right, they should have let me be in control. <laughs> <laughs> right, okay. Charlie Angel. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, okay, we losing everybody. We gotta find. We gotta find them where they going. Yep. Gotta find them quick. Okay. Um, I really want to know what they having for dinner because. Right. Maybe I'll order that too. Okay, well, Charlie, if you're out there, can you send me a, a request? <laughs> I love Charlie if you're out there. Okay, Charlie and Tammy, if y'all are in here, just comment anything and then you can type you can tap their name and add them in. Yeah. Yeah. Pardon yeah, me. if y'all just comment, just say I'm here. For everybody who's uh tuning in, look, mm -hmm. if you have any questions that you want me as to ask Waka, Tammy, or Charlie, please write it in the mm -hmm. Cuz I know y'all got some juicy ju juicy questions. Yes. Dude, I'm like, man. Okay, Waka's comment commenting again. We can try to get him back in here. Okay, let's get him back. Okay, hey. make sure to send y'all's questions. Where is everybody from in here? Where is everybody from? Tap in. Okay. I'm back. Hey. Okay. How is it going? Have have you made it to your destination? <laughs> no, don't worry. My iPhone, we good. Okay, perfect. Okay, cool. I gotta now we your <laughs> add your beautiful wife. I gotta add her. Let me yeah, find. Yeah, and Charlie together. Okay. Okay, perfect. Okay, Cleveland, Chicago. Hey, from Dayton. Greenboro, Jason, North Carolina. So, Waka, are you in Atlanta right now? Yeah, I'm definitely in Atlanta. Nice. Period. That's what we were just talking about. I had to Atlanta's go get that deal. I had to go get that Geo chicken, man. Charlie, oh, okay. That's Tammy, what I was just asking. Tammy wanted salad. I got salad and olive chicken. Okay. I love Geo's. It's always going to hit. That's, that's the best Italian. Okay. Okay. Boston, Louisiana. Got ends. Oh. <laughs> Okay, for some reason I can't find her on it. Can it, Tammy? It's Charlie's. No, it's Charlie's with an S and Angel with three L's. Let's see. You can type it in, Ty. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Hold on. Let me turn. Um, what is this? Trolls off. Charlie's. She going to Angel. Sleep. Angels. They got H Town in here. Some folks got a little turkey restaurant in, in Houston. <laughs> Miss that. Mm -hmm. Somebody just added Tammy on the screen. <laughs> yeah. It's not coming up. I know she has to follow WeTV. WeTV don't follow up. Uh oh. 
That's probably what it is, though. That's what it is, then. That's exactly what it is. Yeah, because they say we have to follow each other for this to work. Of you, Flocka, listen, on the show Tuesday, and for everybody who's just coming in, we're talking to Waka Flocka. He is the star, one of the stars of What the Flocka is on WeTV. Season <laughs> episode two comes out tonight, 9 p.m. Where are you going to be watching uh, season two at? In the house. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. <laughs> do you guys, like, in watch it crib? together and, like, you know, do you guys sit down and watch it together? Because I know when, um, on our family show, I hate watching it back. But that may just be me. Oh, you ain't like watching it together? No, I just feel embarrassed seeing myself and hearing myself. So I never watch it. Most of the time, we all be in separate rooms when the commercials come on. We be like, man, dang, you look fat. I look fat, too. You <laughs> so it's always fun to be in separate rooms. Do you ever like watching the show and y'all in separate rooms and you see something on the show that you didn't know either Tammy was going to do or say or Charlie was going to do or say and then they just piss you off? Of course. Every episode. Oh, God. (laughs) It's every episode. (laughs) Every episode. Tell them, bro. It's every episode. (laughs) No, seriously. It'd be the interviews for me. When you see see your family in interviews talking shit about you, that'd be the part for me. Jeez. Like such and such could be so selfish. And, yeah, you know, you're like, damn, you just ain't hated me this morning. Like, what? No, seriously. <laughs> Wait, me. I feel like in Atlanta, I feel like all the famous black people know each other. So, do you feel like you run into Zanique or you know other famous black folks all the time? Like, do y'all run into each other often? I don't know. Yeah, I don't go outside much. Yeah, you when you go out, you run into X, Y, and Z. Oh, that'd be love. For sure. You know, some people be stiff, though. You know, some people don't know how the other person go react, or you don't want cameras mm-hmm. to be like, oh, you doing this. And sometimes people mm-hmm. keep their distance. But for the most part, shit, everybody be cool. Yeah. But I feel like, Waka, I feel like your energy is so chill and cool. I can't see a person having a problem with you. Well, no, nah, no, I don't got no problem. You did. Yeah, nah. Waka is definitely chill. <laughs> So let me talk to you about the show a little bit, because I want to, like, the the last week we got to see the preparation for Charlie's quinceanera. Now, Charlie, she took dance with this dope choreographer who's worked with uh, Beyonce and Mariah Carey. So do you feel Wait, Antar. Yes. You see um, Tammy? She commented. What did she say? She said, I'm here. Okay, let's see if I can get her. I can get her. Oh, we got her. Okay. Okay, okay, we didn't want to miss her. Yeah, bring some sexiness in. Okay. Damn. Hey, hey ladies. Hello. Oh, they, came in, they came in checking us. I they can't. Okay. There we go. There we go. Hey, ladies. How y'all doing? I'm trying to figure this thing out. It's okay. I was That's trying right. to figure So you no. are not alone. <laughs> we just all have no, a problem. You no. No, yeah, flip okay. it sideways. Yeah, right there. Okay, okay. Business. That's perfect. That's perfect. How y'all doing tonight? We good. Yeah. I feel like I just saw y'all like yesterday. <laughs> but... Right. And I literally have the same shirt on because I wear this shirt in the house all the time. <laughs> That's me. I do the same thing. I wear this on a mix like three times. <laughs> so good. So walk in in route to get your food because you wanted this particular type of food. So he's like, he's an amazing black it's man. Her. It's her who wanted oh, it. Oh, Charlie. Geo's. Come you were on that. Yeah, let's go to Geo's. But you was real hyped about it, though. Yeah, I was hyped. We <laughs> brought it up. It's all right. I love Geo's, too, y'all. That is not- <laughs> I love Geo's. I, I love it. Okay, so before you guys made it in, we were talking about um, Atlanta and... Mm-hmm. Atlanta being like the black mecca, especially for celebrities and running into other black celebrities. Like, do you feel like in Atlanta, you kind of just see everybody all the time? Like, do you see Zanique all the time, like running into Atlanta? No, I might see me time. I actually don't see her a lot. I've seen her a few times out. Uh, but I, I, I that. you do, you run into a lot of other, you know, black celebs because it's like black house. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I pe- feel like people move to Atlanta thinking that they're going to run into celebrities all the time. <laughs> that's how I feel when I went to Atlanta I always feel like I'm going to see like certain celebrities 
all the time. Just going to the mall, especially what is it, Linux or Phipps? Linux, they be at. See the celebs. The celebs. We don't go to Linux on a, on the weekends. Uh -huh. so we have to go to. We don't go, but if we have to go, it's usually like ten o'clock on the weekday. So anybody go get there. <laughs> <laughs> Ty, you was asking um walk or something you can get into that because i cut you off for all the new viewers in here we are talking to the beautiful family the stars of we tvs what the flockas we got tammy rivera we have the beautiful darty daughter charlie and of course we got waka so now and tonight uh season episode on night on we are yeah, going check that out so Last week, we got to see Charlie preparing for her quinceanera. So is it quinceanera or quinceanera? It's the same. It's just the way that you pronounce it. Like, it's just the pronunciation, but it's the same. You know, okay. black people. Like, I'm a quinceanera. Like, I'm, like I'm Latino. Quinceanera. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> okay. And for quinceanera. Now, Charlie, you're working with a dope choreographer who works with Beyonce and Mariah Carey. So how was it, like, learning with him and learning to dance moves from him? Um, it was, it was fun, but he was great. <laughs> and you know, all my friends and I are goofy. So it was like, we were laughing and he was like, you take this serious, this is serious. And it was just so funny to us, but every time we kept getting in trouble. So it was like, he's a good choreographer, but he's real strict. And I was about to lose it. Cause you know, <laughs> I was, you know. You were holding it together, though. Yeah, right. Together. No, seriously. Yeah. Wait, now, Charlie, I saw you did a Beauty and the Beast theme, and I was just wondering, why did you pick that? Not to dazzle me. Because I love uh, Disney. I did the Beauty and the Beast theme because... And I'm listening. I don't even... I think it was more... Dad, <laughs> my dad's more of, like, a big macho man in the Beauty and the Beast. I love her dress. It was giving okay. me a yellow dress. And we want to do it with the Little Mermaid, because that's, that's my favorite. favorite. That's not okay. Anyways. So I think she it's her favorite because I, it was my favorite and as a child I used to make her watch it. And we did, I said now it became her no. favorite. Oh, we were gonna do Little Mermaid and then we seen this big yellow dress that had like a rose in between it and that's when we was like, Yeah, I think we're gonna change the idea. No, we were thinking about Melissa Melissa Maleficent. Too. Yeah, we were thinking about a whole bunch of things. So we found okay. that yellow dress was like, Okay, we're gonna do the Oh. Well, listen, I've been watching TikTok, and you got some moves, like, and you have a nice little following, too. so I have to ask you, between Waka and Tammy, who would you choose to be your backup dancer? Oh. Mm. Damn, is that hard? Mmm. <laughs> 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 so I, I want the truth. I want the truth. Don't, don't. Right. Do don't sugar cut. Mama there. I want the truth. Waka listens. My mom is hard headed. So, with that being said, when I do certain dances, you know, she's not going to listen to everything that I say. She, I want to do it this way because I just want to do it this way. Waka <laughs> follow directions. He's not good at following directions. Oh, so, because he follows directions. Waka ain't got no real room, but he follows directions. <laughs> he follows directions when he bought the Wait, you Waka smile, Waka like, yeah. <laughs> right. Uh huh. <laughs> I got this. I definitely got this. <laughs> that dance will look dumb. But go ahead. Uh, oh, well, Tammy, you also showed us your moves in tonight's episode. So, can we expect to see more dancing from you? Maybe even like Waka tonight in the episode? Is that going to happen? You probably Ooh. see more. No, uh, no, Tammy, you. you, you don't. I didn't get, you know, you know, I was, I didn't get a, a special dance. So, you know, it was like daddy, daughter. Dang, she a hater, whole hater. Um, I saw that. I have moves though because like back in the day, I used to be like in all the dance groups in Baltimore. Like I was in a marching band. Yeah. I was in Charm City marching band back in Baltimore, and I used okay. to win all the competitions. So I still got a little bit in me when I like really try. Like I know y'all be seeing me do the stuff, like the challenges and stuff. Uh huh. Uh. I be doing those because I be feeling like you know I still got it. <laughs> Wait, can I just can I just. <laughs> On, <laughs> I know that Walker is giving us right now. I used to be, baby, but I used to dance like James Brown too. But that don't mean that Charlie likes me as a partner. So, so you, you said she, I moved. you told me I did what needed to be done. Then I, I did. I definitely felt like she did what needed to be done in the closet. But but Charlie did choose. 
Yes. <laughs> but Charlie can really, really, really can dance. Charlie really can dance. Yeah, she danced a lot when she was younger. I don't know why she don't do it no more. So everybody in the comments, can you please comment who you think should be Charlie's background dancer? Or who you think got better? <laughs> Baca or is it Tim? Are we we going to see. Saying Zani, can you look to see who, who people? Oh act? yeah, I look. I already saw one for Tammy already, so I'm glad you asked. <laughs> so I definitely want to see what people have to say. <laughs> yeah. Okay. okay, so Tammy, I want to ask you because I saw that you talked about how you're scared to release your music because you just feel like it's so personal to you. So, do you still feel like hesitant about it now, or do you feel like you push your fears to the side? I'm still very hesitant about it, but um, I don't spend too much money and I got to put it out and it's great music and everyone keeps asking me for it. Everyone who listens to it or who's heard it is like, you know, why are you oh, not? Why you Lord, Charlie. Sorry, man. But, um, yeah, I mean, I'm just, it's, I, music is just a touchy thing for me, period. It's just mm -hmm. something that is I take very personal and I feel it's funny because people can say whatever else, but when they talk about my music or they say something about like I, I, I you know, you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's your art. I uh -huh. know that. Well, you know, um, you started yeah. on uh, on Tuesday with us on the mix. Mm -hmm. and you were telling the same thing, and I'm I'm so happy that on the show you let other people know who are going through that same issue of like not feeling like they want to put out music or do anything that they felt they have a love for. But you're, it's very inspiring to see that you actually say, no, nah, if you have a love for something, do it. doesn't matter what age you are. doesn't yeah. matter if you have the right people behind you or not. Just do it. Love that you showed on the show. Yeah. It's like, I mean, people are going to talk regardless. So if you let other people fear, fear stop you from doing something. Oh. Yeah, I always tell Charlie, like when they say, like you know, she had like a little moment the other day. <laughs> oh my <laughs> God, we were saying certain mean things about her kinsei and her date and that sort. And I told her, I said, you know, one week they talk about. I said, one week they love you, next week they hate you. Both weeks you got paid. Hey, period. <laughs> See, this is why I'm saying to show you. <laughs> There's gems like this, you know what I mean? Like beautiful gems. I love it. Oh, so beautiful. <laughs> it's so irky. Oh, wait, uh, I think he outside. Oh, I think Walker just pulled up. Yeah, he's outside. He just pulled up. <laughs> he said, I'm coming in with y'all. Oh, that's part. Um, I wanted to say too, because we was talking about your music. I've worked with Sean Garrett a couple of times and every time that I work with him, he speaks so highly of the stuff that y'all working on. Every oh, time. Yeah, every he, time. He has like done some We've done some fire records together. You know, Open Door for Your Father. Mm -hmm. See, they so ghetto. Like, they know we had a live. Like, they <laughs> We love it. But we roll with the punches. But I love the fact that you guys are real people. And that's why people right. do watch y'all show. Because they want people who are like them, who are real, mm -hmm. who are down earth, who are humble. You know what I mean? They don't want to see, like, the put togetherness. They want to see, like, mm -hmm. this is real stuff. It's real stuff. Right. I gave y'all a swoop today. Because they... Yeah. Yeah, they won't like this. I gave y'all a little slick up in the suit. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. So I was asking Waka where he's going to be watching. So are you actually going to be, um, are you too scared to watch yourself or are you going to be watching it with the family? I'm going to watch it with them. Well, Charlie don't ever watch anything. Well, she don't even be camera, really. Uh, me and Waka watch it together. And usually we just sit up there and criticize the hell out of each other. Like That's what he said. That's what he said. <laughs> yeah. Like, somebody... He called, he texted, it was funny, we had a group chat and we were talking about <laughs> he said, why didn't nobody, he cussed me and his brothers, his brothers, me and my sisters, all of us out. He was like, why ain't nobody tell me I look like a garbage truck? And so I was like, well shit, did anybody tell me I look like a fat ass donut? Okay. <laughs> and so my mom, so my mom comes in the group chat and he put a picture of her and Deb and they called, Deb had on all yellow and my, my mom had on all yellow, Deb had on all red. I mean, wigs and everything. <laughs> So I'm like, they look like some fat ass crayon. <laughs> <laughs> Not necessarily. Uh, okay. Group text, and she's like, Tammy, you need to stop crying on TV. You like a booger. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. <laughs> that's the part. That's the part about like reality TV that I would be so scared to do because they literally show every bad angle. They show everything. Mm -hmm. They show the bad, the good, the beautiful, all the in between. So like, I salute y'all. I salute y'all putting yourself out there and showing. What a beautiful black family is, too, though. Mm -hmm. And her, 
she when it's time for her to feel, she be like, oh, I'll, she, I'm just going downstairs like this. So she'll go downstairs, her hair mess, and then when the show come on, she be like, why would y'all let me get on camera like that? I do this. Oh, Charlie, baby, we sound a lot alike because I don't care to watch it either. And I do the same thing. Like, I will miss my makeup. Like, I don't care. Like, I'm just going to film it. We supposed to look natural. And then I look on the TV. And then I'm like, well, who let me do that? Uh, uh, <laughs> we the only one looking crazy. I want to let everybody know to make sure y'all uh, put a heart if y'all like the conversation. Make sure y'all put a heart if y'all love the show. Put a heart if y'all going to be watching tonight, 9 p.m. Mm -hmm. on WeTV. Make sure y'all like it. Also, too, any questions y'all want us to ask them, please put it in the comments, and we're going to decide. Now, don't go crazy with the questions, okay? Now, be be nice with the right. questions. Sorry, because if they don't, they will get their ass cussed out, okay? Hey, come on. Period. Come yeah, on. we could do, Um, we should do viewer questions when Waka comes back. Absolutely. Let me see if I can actually, uh, add, is Waka ready? Should I add Waka again? He no. right there. Hey. It's the okay. family. Oh, family, come on. Right here. No, you got. You just want to eat. Sit down so you can do the questions. Sit down. Sit down. Oh, this mess. Family, family, family's getting. Oh, yeah, girl. Okay, let's see you. <laughs> okay, so Charlie, okay. I love um, y'all Instagram handles and that y'all named it after each other. I think it's like so loving and so cute. Who came up with that? She had Instagram first, so yes, yeah, so I was Charlie's Angels first, and then when she came, she created her. I didn't come up with the idea. God she... I'm gone, Daddy. Like the angel. No, no that's why. Oh, why are you on our live? Because y'all look good. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> and eats. <Thank> <laughs> okay, can I, I'm about to twist it this way then, y'all, because you can't no, see you all can. of us. We can see you. Okay. Yeah, we can see you guys. Good. Okay, so now I want to get into some uh, fan questions, if y'all yeah. don't mind. Mm -hmm. okay, Get a little juicy, all right? Mm -hmm. So okay. here we go. Okay, so okay. what is the best advice to succeed in a long-term healthy relationship? This no, is no, from at, at BTCX underscore. Um, I would say communication, understanding, mm. and prayer. Mm. Yeah. And I say understanding because you got to be able to put yourself in the other person's shoe and try to understand them even when you don't. Come on. Yeah. You know, it's interesting. I think uh, I always hear people, actually, you know, it's one person. I always hear Wendy Williams say, like, if you are in a great relationship, do not go and do reality TV because it ends relationships. But I think you guys kind of dispel that because you guys seem stronger than ever and the love that you show on the show is so beautiful to watch. How do you maintain such love for each other in being in the, the public eye and being on reality TV? If me and Walker were to separate, it won't be because of no TV. I'll tell you that much. Like we've been through so much, you know, things on and off TV. Like it's not, it's not the TV that separate people. It's the character of the people that get separated because mm -hmm. If you want to let these, like I tell them straight up, when we first started our show, I was like, listen, this is my real life. This is my family. I don't care about, when it comes to my family, TV don't matter. You get what I'm saying? This is a part of our business. But at the end of the day, you have to have enough understanding with each other and enough uh, morals and character to be able to be like, oh, no, nah, we're not going for that. We're not doing that. Mm -hmm. I feel like people, relationships break up because they get on TV and they let one producer tell them to say this. And, and, and when you know your partner, why would you allow, you know what I'm saying, something to, you know, why why do that? So usually it's 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 not the TV, it's the characteristics of the people. Come on. Come on. Hey, I now. love y'all. Okay. Okay, guys, I see this one, and I want to notice myself. It's such a simple question, but Waka, on the show, you call yourself Waka Flocka. Now, what happened to the flame? <laughs> you... Well, that's the one. That's, wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> Come on. ACL in the building, please let me know. Come on. What happened? What happened to the flame? The flame, man. Uh, you know, I just dimmed the light. Okay. That's the joint, uh, Charlie. Oh. But not, 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 I'm just playing. I just, <laughs> Wait a minute. I guess that was that was me saying I put the, the like music on ice. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And now I can say I'm walking for the flame now. Mm. I, 
grown. She know who she is today. I ain't scared. She ain't grown, grown. She grown enough to know what what that's going on. You know what I mean? Facts. Well, yeah. why, since you brought it up, since you brought up the music, and I'm a personal fan. Like I'm, a, I'm actually a really big fan of your music, dog. On Tuesday, mm -hmm. on the mix, you said that you were possibly gonna drop some new music in April. Is is that definite? Is that happening? And please, please tell the people that, how this is going to span. It's possibly. Possible, I mean. First week of April, second week, who knows? Ooh, I love to hear that. Huh? <laughs> hey. I said, I love to hear that. The street's been waiting on walking. No cap. Bruh. <laughs> I'm home. It's coming up. We can't so wait. I, I want to drop it so exclusive. I'm going to drop it in the NFT. Artwork. Okay. Can you explain to people what NFT is? Because I don't think a lot of people know. Non fungible tokens. NFT is basically digital art. It's what an art. It's basically a platform where the artist has power. Where artists is not making mixtape covers and album covers for three hundred dollars. They getting with with his work. That's an. Uh, and I'm dropping my NFT on a platform called Satoshi Art. Hmm. Okay. Making more money than you would if you were just doing it the old fashioned way and more control. I don't think it's worth the money. I think it's worth me going out of the system that made me fall out of love with music. Mm. I, I, it's a it's a humble beginning, it's a new beginning. Let me let me do this. Let me put it with some visuals. Mm. We love that. Okay, I know we have to get into Tammy's music first, but you know I want to ask the questions that I want to know. <laughs> so I see this question. First I want to ask Charlie, what's your zodiac sign? I'm a cancer. Mm. Oh, I love cancers. Ah, wait a minute, wait a minute. I love cancers. Oh. So you're a cancer and you have your parents are Gemini and Leo. Oh my god. Ooh. Like in your shell. You must be in in the back of time because their their energy can be overwhelming. A Leo oh, and Gemini. I'm a I'm an Aries. Aries. Oh. But, but, I, but, I, but I love y'all because y'all that's that fire. I'm a fire sign. Okay, but I asked that because this question, I have a Sagittarius, mind you. This question says, is it hard having a teenage daughter? Because I need to know. I'm about to have a whole Sagittarius problem. Girl, let me turn this camera. It's <laughs> y'all both. Um, yes. It's not mm. hard. It's only hard if you don't, if you, you got, okay, you have to realize that this is um, your kid. Because there are going to be times when you really don't like this person that they become. Mm. You have to love them as a parent. You get what I'm saying? But mm -hmm. you're not going to like them for probably a year. A whole year. But no, seriously, but it, the hardest part is being able to balance the friendship and the parenting. Okay. Like, now she almost got smacked because she said she was going to like me. So you got to be like, okay, was that worth a slap? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I love that. <laughs> <laughs> that but no, no, seriously. So it's like you have to know how to balance. So there's times that we talk about, like, me and her have a really good relationship. We talk about a lot of stuff. And she can come to me with a lot of things that most children probably wouldn't, or most teenagers would be afraid to go to their parents about. I have that open door of communication. Mm -hmm. But then because we are so close and we have that homegirl relationship, she can get carried away sometimes, but I have to be like, I ain't your motherfucking friends now. Mm -hmm. I, mm -hmm. you know like, to, I'm, who you talking to? I ain't your friends. That's when that I, bottle come out. That bottle might right. I know, Zonika, I know your mom and I told you that before. And yeah, I, I was, I was <laughs> going to say, me and my mom have definitely had those times. I'll be, be like, you're my best friend, and I get to talking a little crazy. Uh-huh. <laughs> so, those, like, for the most part is, it's just hard watching them grow into a new person and just like have their own thing and their own personality. Right. And you got to realize that they're not you. They're not going to walk the way you walk, talk the way you talk. They're going to be their own person. So now saying that and going through the journey of having a child and now a teenager, would you do it all over again? Would you have any more kids? It's Charlie. Charlie is me. <laughs> oh. Yes. She is me. Um, it's Charlie, like, why don't you want her to have any more kids? I just feel like if they have a child, their personality is going to be that one child, you know? And then I'm going to have to deal with this. You're going to be like a baby. Put together. 
Oh, so you don't want it. I no, just, you can wait, but you if you have a little sibling, you can have it. I mean, I'll babysit when it's five. I'm not ready for that. So, her, so she's a no. I, okay. five, five, I go through five, seven, six. You don't even like Yuri. You don't like Yuri. Hey, exactly. So, what makes you think I'm like my own sibling? Damn. <laughs> so she puts out her room. They're five, six, seven, and eight. So, I'm. Oh. So yeah, my, Amy, would you would you want another kid? I could do one more child, maybe. <laughs> Walker, it's maybe what I can do a hundred kids. Ooh, Ooh. Yeah. Charlie has, that means Charlie is a perfect child. Yep, that's what that means. Mm hmm. Absolutely. Okay, so everybody who's just tuning in, I want to remind everybody I'm Anton Peoples. I'm an actor singer and I'm one of the hosts on the mix. And he got our beautiful girl, Zanique, here. And we are talking to the stars of What the Flockers on WeTV tonight. Tonight, y'all. Make sure y'all tune in tonight. Season two, episode two. We have Waka, of course. We got the beautiful Tammy Rivera. And we have a beautiful daughter, Charlie. So I want to ask y'all another question from one of the fans Do you guys regret the camera catching everything? Do you? Regret you talk first. You, you never ask about. Do you regret the cameras catching everything? Third things like on camera that you don't want up there, like they're catching. Um. Like what? Cry, my crying moments, because I cry like my mama. I did not want that on TV. Like, ugh. What you mean you cry like your mama? Ugly. I, <laughs> I got ugly. <laughs> we go. Like, you can't say no because we both cry ugly. I used to have. <laughs> you ain't had no cute cry. Your crush is well, you don't do it. Your face, exactly. My face is the same. <laughs> He's walking the back. I know. I come back like, what's going on? <laughs> now they do crying all, all in the movies and everything. We watch the movies. Cry, and no, I got Tammy just start crying. He's like, why are you crying? Oh. <laughs> <Aww. laughs> okay. Well, I will ask another uh, question from the fans. Let's see. Y'all know I'm gonna ask one more. What? Okay, here's a good one. You guys have been together for a minute. So how do you guys keep it spicy? Because I need to know. Damn me answer that. Well, I got to answer that. <laughs> <laughs> I guess you got to. Bucky, you want to answer that one? No. <laughs> Not, no. Oh, well, maybe, maybe we shouldn't. Maybe I shouldn't ask that because Charlie's uh, right here. She don't want to hear that. She doesn't ask that. No, I guess more so you have to. Mm -hmm. You have, there's going to be times where you, same thing with your kid. You're not going to like your partner. You're not going to like, you know what I'm saying? Like, they're going to get on your nerves. You're not going to be wanting to be around them. You don't want them to touch you. You know, I guess you have to find that, that love again, like re-fall in love with some, you know, with that person. Try to fall, find the things that you fell in love with from the beginning. Because um, sometimes you can go through a lot of shit and you, it just, it clouds all the good things. You know what I'm saying? How do you keep the spice? You, you answer the damn question. <laughs> he want to know what you got to say. <laughs> I said what the hell I got to say. I said what I said. She did. And she did. I, I got the message. Be transparent. And I'm, you know, in a relationship right now. And we've been through some shit. Like, um, stuff. Excuse me. <laughs> no, you fine. We've been doing some stuff. And, you know, so I would like to know, like, what is it or what are the few things that you can do to bring the love back in the relationship? And I'm sure a lot of people go through the same situations. Like, what, for you, just name, like, one or two things that was like, okay, this is bringing the love back. This is bringing us back to when we first met each other and everything was good. I think you just can't forget that friendship. That's more so than anything else. Like you, no matter what you go through, I think a lot of times we focus so much on the relationship and not the yeah. friendship of it. Because the, once the relationship, once the friendship is gone, there is no relationship. Ooh. So, you know, gotta focus on the actual friendship. Like yo, that's really like I know. Like if you, if God forbid, if you go outside and you get in a, if he get in a fight or you, you, you get in a fight, I'm you're gonna swinging. be like, oh, I'm swinging. Well, I'm, a, I'm gonna have my partner's back, and I know yeah. they're gonna have my back. Those are the parts that then afterwards you're like, damn, this really is my, this, this my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is my <laughs> period. Wow, Waka, you definitely have a gem for a wife. Like, okay. I'm just loving Tammy right now. I love all y'all, but I love Tammy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so I got to know, how was you guys' first date? How did y'all meet? Like, where did, where's the beginning of this? Can I explain the story? I want to know. Go ahead, tell us. Okay, so basically what happened was, not what had happened was, but go ahead. My mama. 
Mm -hmm. She had went. I meant she had dirty face. Okay, we can explain that. (laughs) (laughs) That was that was the story. So, what I was told was my mama was in Miami with her best friend. Mm-hmm. Okay. Break or something. Mm-hmm. And Waka had a show. So mm-hmm. they had went to the club because her best friend wanted to see Waka. She was in love with Waka. So my mama ended up leaving and he ended up following my mama. And I was like, why are you following me? And he was like, you're going to be my wife one day. Mm-hmm. Oh. Okay. <laughs> That's like Martin. Everybody got a story. That was a story. Yeah. That was the story. In a wait, wait, let me get this clear. So you went to see Walker because your best friend was in love with Walker? No, we were. Support- My best friend was a huge Walker fan. Had his posters and wow. everything. They all used to love him. She can't ass now, but <laughs> no, I'm just joking. But um, yeah. So she she was a Walker fan. And she wanted to go to the club that he was going to be at. I didn't want to go to that club because I felt like it was going to be too ratchet. And I wanted to go to, like, a cute little classy vibe. Mm-hmm. So we ended up going to the club that I wanted to go to. And I don't know what happened at the club. That it he was whack. Yeah, no, no, you ended up coming to the club that we was at. It was whack. Because you ended up following her. No, uh, that's not. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, that you was told me he followed you. <laughs> yeah, on the street. Okay. Was... All of them got their own. Uh, right, everybody got their own. Like, you know how about the time you tell the story and it get passed out? She uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, I, t- I heard two days. I mean, he followed you, and that was that. Period. Period. No, I love that. Um, sincerely, Shore said, "I knew Tammy loved Waka deeply when he popped up on a Jamaica girls trip on Leia." Love and him. Tammy's reaction love after her favorite. performance is golden. That's when she knew you fell in love with him, or you were in love with him. I was falling, trying to fall back in love with him at that moment because if y'all remember, that's he followed me to Jamaica because he was trying to get back on my good side. You always trying to follow I somebody. Never... I, what's up with this? Yeah, people? like, why well, I, I should have called the police on you. Stop it. <laughs> but you know what? That's a beautiful thing. So, like, you will that's fight, you will travel across the world to save the love of your life and to save the man that is beautiful. Period. Oh, it's so sweet. <laughs> <laughs> that says a lot about that black man. See more black men and to be like that, you know, save your relationship. Let's not say that, man. Why not? You know why? Because I'm not trying to. Uh, I'm not. I'm not trying to be like this, this. This image of it, but I just want people to know, man. When you love somebody, you really. Excuse me, Charlie. Fuck with them hard and tough. You gotta do what you gotta do. Cause mm-hmm. they, they, what they gonna say? Yo, you soft. You lame. You a simp. I'm gonna show you how to reverse your words. Cause at the end of the day, this is how I feel. It's, she it's she, she told me what a simp was. I didn't know what that was. Come on, Tammy. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I don't know what the simp is either, so I, I, I was trying to be cool. Yeah, yeah. come on. Why are we on live with them, Charlie? Who are you? <laughs> Period. I know. It's, it's <laughs> them. I know. <laughs> That's because, Walker, you want to be hip so bad. You only know because Charlie told you. Simps? You know how long simping? Hey, Jody, you know because it's you. Like, <laughs> yeah, but no, the, um, on the mix, Walker did say that Charlie keeps y'all up on game, so. So how you know what a simp is? Because you, I be on Twitter and stuff, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I be in the mix, oh, for real. <laughs> yeah, I really be in the mix, you know? Before we take any more questions, I have to uh, remind everybody to make sure you tune in tonight, 9 p.m. with the Flockers. Mm-hmm. And then after that, 10 p.m., they're also going to be uh, joining them in Clubhouse. <laughs> make sure y'all go to Clubhouse. Walker's going to be in the Clubhouse at 10 p.m. Make sure y'all go mm-hmm. check that out as well. But 9 p.m., make sure y'all go check it out. What the Flockers. We TV. Okay, Zania, you got another question for us? I was going to say, do we have time? Because I know the show is coming on soon. People need oh, to have, be getting it on their TV. Okay. We done. Okay. Okay, let me see. Let me see. Get us a good one. Get us a good one to close it out. Okay. Go. Get us a nice juicy <laughs> something. Um, I want to add something not relationship because I've been asking all relationships. <laughs> um, okay, <laughs> so I'm going to say... About the show, what somebody said, what episode are you most excited for us to see? Mm. What episode, Kinsey? Mm-hmm. For you, yeah. For me, oh, your breath is rocking. Taco guys, and you gotta go. <laughs> oh my god. Um, okay. uh, I think my the, my the episode that I'm most excited to see. Mm-hmm. What's a good one? Um, the Kinsey. I feel like that's some like a good. Episode. Girl, that was your good episode. Why <laughs> you got my heart? <laughs> <Okay. good. laughs> It's all about me this season. Oop. I'm going to let him know. Let him know. We trying to see Charlie this season. You know what I'm saying? It's time for Charlie to shine, baby. It's time for Charlie okay. to shine. 
<laughs> well, I guess you can say the best episode for me would be when you, I was. Girl, you never. <laughs> <laughs> That's what can say. It's a, what? I know. Never mind. I changed, I changed my mind on that one. Which one? I can't say it. Oh, I'm going to tell y'all. Oh, I can't even say it. I yeah. can't say it. Y'all can't oh. say it. Nope. Waka, what about you? Do you got anything that you're excited coming up? What did he say? I'm waiting to to see um, that I've been telling her not to do. And now she it's like an episode where you're going to see why I've been telling her that. And she's going to learn her lesson. But that's the episode I'm waiting <laughs> That's the well, one you're ready to see. <laughs> you <know what? laughs> Entire season, okay? You're gonna have to tune in. My episode was very memorable. Mm -hmm. Okay, and make sure to follow Walker and Tammy on Clubhouse. You said they'll be on there on 10. Yeah, so Walker and Tammy are going to Clubhouse as soon as the episode ends. And you can go to uh Walker's Instagram story to see the link. So make sure y'all go join them at Clubhouse. But make sure more than anything that y'all watch this incredible show. I love y'all. I love this family. We I love, love y'all. Black family like this you know what i mean this is beautiful y'all take a screenshot please okay in my damn ear <laughs> well thank y'all so much for kicking it with us i appreciate the love waka mm -hmm. charlie i look sexy in the back <laughs> boy stop trying to look kind of flex and look sexy in the back like boy <laughs> 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 you gotta suck in and poke out boy bye. Okay. Yeah. Uh, but make sure y'all watch tonight 9 p.m and then go to clubhouse right after at 10 p.m thank mm -hmm. y'all uh, thank you guys. See you. I thought you was gonna put the baby. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see you. I'm gonna see you pictures of her. Okay, thank you. <laughs> do you want? Do you want to show the baby? You know, just maybe a little. I bit. think I think her godmom just put her to sleep, so we don't want to like you know interrupt that. Got it. We don't Got want to interrupt it. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Night, night, PM. We TV. Peace.